my heart goes out to them. But I, I can tell you, they're they're uh, they're young people. They're optimistic. They're they uh, they're appreciative. They're they're just wonderful young people. That that the, the first thing they're doing is thanking everybody at the hospital. They're thanking the police. They're thanking the first responders. They are thankful to be alive. Uh, they're they're you know they know some they've lost some of their friends and that they're they're you know they're sad about that. And uh, in my case, I'm mad. I mean, I'm mad that that this happens. They told me their stories of what happened to them, and and you know you just you're. You just hope this never happens again. I'm going to do everything I can to make sure this doesn't happen in our state again. I don't want it to happen in our country again. Next week, I'm going to sit down with state leaders. I'm going to bring people together, and we're going to figure out what we can do to have an impact on school safety and making sure that somebody that has mental illness does not have access to a gun.